What's up everybody, Jan Dittus here, back with a new tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you guys how this number 8 in 3D is created in Illustrator. It's created with the Blend tool and I'm going to show you how. So open Illustrator for this, click on the rectangle tool and drag our rectangle. Get rid of the fill color. Click on the selection tool and turn this one 45 degrees. And we want to make these corners a little bit rounded. Okay. Press on the C for the scissor tool and click on the anchor point over here. It cuts the anchor point, the part in two anchor points. Select one anchor point and press with holding shift on the one top arrow. Select this element, drag it with holding shift and option to the bottom side and turn it 180 degrees and align it on the same anchor point as the other one. And now we are going to select both anchor points and press on command J. This um, adds the two anchor points. So now the path is connected with each other. Click on this anchor point and press on the down arrow with holding shift. Same for this one on the top arrow. So this is the number eight as a path and now we are going to create the blend. Drag a rectangle, give it a black fill color and add some lines to it with the line segment tool. Hold shift and drag a line and give it a white fill color. Okay, we are going to duplicate this line a few times. Select all the lines, press on command G Select the box as well, click once time on the box and then align it to the center. If you select the box, if you double click on the box, you get this thick blue line around it. And this means the alignment is based on the box. So for example, if I have this selected and press on the vertical alignment align bottom it aligns to the bottom and if you press on vertical align center it aligns the lines to the center but the lines has to be a group it's very important okay so for now select this element present command J to group it command G I mean Duplicate it with holding shift and option to the right side. Select them both, go to object, blend, blend options, specified steps and thousand steps. Press an OK. Go to object again, blend and make. Okay. Now select the blend and the part with holding shift. Go to object, blend, replace pine. Okay, so here it is. Crazy looking 8 and 3D. So as you see, this is also created with the blend tool. And it is a really nice technique. You can create different sort of blends with it. And it gives such a nice effect. And you can also choose for like, create a more organic line. So you have a different look and feel uh, on the blend but you can also create the blend with uh, geometric forms and parts. So yeah, hope you liked this video. If you did, please drop a like, follow the channel for more epic tutorial videos, and I see you in my next video. Peace.